All right, so this is a video showing how to take your smart board panel and your device. I've got a PC here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna connect these two wirelessly by sharing the screen. And so the only thing that you gotta make sure that happens is that both are on the same wireless network. So make sure that your computer and your smart panel are on the same wireless network. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do, is set down my computer and drop a chair. And I'm going to press screen share on my smart panel. This brings up the directions. It shows me right here what my internet is and what I'm looking for. And now when I go to my computer screen, I'm going to open up Chrome, and in the top right-hand corner, I'm going to click on the snowman, and I'm going to go down to cast. And since I'm on the same network, you will see that that is the same exact number that is up on my board, A140. And so the one thing that I learned was you want to hit this drop-down menu of sources, because the default is cast tab. And I don't want to just cast the tab, I want to cast my entire desktop. And so when I do that, it says it's available, we click on it, it's connecting. And what you're going to now notice is that we have the same exact thing. So if I change the screen, and I only have one hand here, let me see if I can set this down for a second. As I change to something else, you will see that it changes on the smart panel. And it's pretty responsive. What's great about this is you can, especially if you have a touchscreen device like this is, you can go ahead and use a stylus, you can move around the room, and you can implement that untethered teaching model in your classroom. So that's how you do it. Make sure you're connected to the same Wi-Fi and hopefully you have no issues. Please comment if you do or if it works and let me know how you like it.